Indian state refiners will buy 36% less oil from Saudi Arabia in May than normal, sources said. This is seen as a sign of escalating tensions with Riyadh, even after the kingdom supported the idea of boosting output from OPEC, or Organization of the Petroleum Exporting Countries, and allied producers last week. Energy relations between India, the world's third biggest oil importer and consumer, and Saudi Arabia had soared as global oil prices spiked. New Delhi blames cuts by the Saudis and other oil producers for driving up crude prices as its economy tries to recover from the pandemic. State-run refiners have placed orders to buy 9.5 million barrels of Saudi oil in May, compared with the previously planned 10.8 million barrels, Reuters reports, quoting sources. The refiners, Indian Oil Corporation, Bharat Petroleum Corporation, Hindustan Petroleum Corporation and Mangalore Refinery and Petrochemicals Limited normally buy 14.8 million barrels of Saudi oil in a month. The decision to place nominations for less oil was taken on Monday, within two days of a telephonic conversation between Indian Oil Minister Dharmendra Pradhan and his Saudi counterpart Prince Abdulaziz bin Salman on Saturday, sources said. The Organization of the Petroleum Exporting Countries and its allies, known as opec Plus, agreed on Thursday to gradually ease their oil output cuts from May, after the new U.S. administration called on Saudi Arabia, the de facto leader of the group, to keep energy affordable for consumers. On Sunday, Saudi Aramco, the state oil company of the kingdom, raised official selling price, or OSP, of its oil for Asia while cutting it for Europe, and American markets. We were surprised when they announced cuts for other markets while raising OSPs for Asia, said one of the sources. India suggested that refiners look for energy alternatives to Gulf oil, its main source of crude. Tensions between the two countries further escalated after Abdulaziz last month advised India to use the stocks of crude it bought cheaply during the price slump in 2020. Pradhan termed Abdulaziz's response as Undiplomatic. News Desk, Kaumati English.